As the Mountain Girl Experience prepares to take over downtown Pikeville this weekend, many are gearing up for the workshops, live music, and more that the festival offers. But in addition to all the fun, the festival gives back to the region. This year's proceeds from the festival will be going towards helping mothers leave abusive homes. Mountain Girl Experience chose Oasis Farms to be our char charitable entity this year, if you will, um, because we've gotten to know uh, the, their, the Oasis Farms founder, Jessie Workman, uh, through the years. Uh, she's been with Mountain Girl almost since the start, and we love her passion, and we've just really enjoyed watching you know, her grow uh, in all the things that she does in East Kentucky, you know, she's one of the women that is doing the thing that we love to see strong Appalachian women doing. And it's, you know, she's the type of woman that we want to celebrate uh, with events like Mountain Girl Experience because she's trying to make and is making our area a better place, especially for our women and children. When work and traffic in Floyd County, responding to crashes involving deaths or injuries is the toughest part of our job. When you're driving on Floyd County roads, there's so much out of your control. What you do have control over is wearing a seatbelt. Floyd County, always buckle up. 45% of Kentucky women have experienced domestic violence, which is the second highest rate in the country. Oasis Farms plans to offer housing, childcare, and employment to assist mothers leaving abusive homes. At Oasis, we want to offer uh, employment and housing to moms leaving abuse and address uh, food deserts in eastern Kentucky. So the, the proceeds that they raise um, and the donations that we raise will go towards building the, the first two houses for, Oasis, uh, for the moms coming to work at Oasis. It's just such a beautiful thing what Mountain Girl is doing, um, creating a space for women um, to be uplifted and supported in ways that we don't often get to uh, stand in the spotlight. Um, the, from the art to the vendors to the artists, um, it's just a beautiful thing to see the talents of so many women celebrated. For more information or to make a donation, go to the Mountain Girl Experience on Facebook. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.